Kuwait City is the capital of Kuwait. The city is located at the heart of the country on the shore of the Arabian Gulf. Perhaps Kuwait is not one of the most inspiring touristic hotspots in the Middle East. There's enough to do to spend a day or two. One of the main places you have to visit is the Old Souk in the heart of the Old Center. There are many nice small alleys where they sell about anything. A traditional souk is always set up in sections. All shops that sell fruits are in one section. And there's a section for meat, for clothes, carpets or even teapots. So just stroll around the market to find your section and buy your stuff. Nearby the old souk you'll find the Grand Mosque, which is the largest and the official mosque in the country of Kuwait. During some hours of the day, it is possible for non-Muslims to visit the mosque. Shopping can be done in one of the nice shopping malls in Kuwait. One of the largest malls in whole Middle East is The Avenues. It features a lot of clothing and electronic stores. A great place for shopping nearby the old center is Shark Market Waterfront. This mall has a perfect blend of first-class retail outlets and great recreational activities. There are many food options here, and while having your drink, lunch or dinner, you will get a great view on the marina and the skyline of Kuwait City. Next to Shark Market is the new Fish Market. Perhaps you don't need to buy fish here, but for sure you'll get some great picturesque moments. And for fish and seafood lovers, the view on the fresh products will definitely stimulate your appetite. More shopping can be done at Marina Mall further down in the direction of Salmir. It is a complete destination with top quality shopping, dining, leisure and entertainment facilities. After you've finished your shopping, you should walk the Marina Bridge and go to Marina Crescent. Around the marina, you will find a lot of restaurants and coffee bars. In front of Marina Crescent, you can start your walk along the Corniche. Stretching over 10 kilometers, you can enjoy winding paths, parks and beaches on Arabian Gulf Street. The Corniche is marked at its southern end by the scientific center and at its northernmost point by the Kuwait Towers. Stop off at one of the many beaches, restaurants or coffee houses to watch a beautiful sunset. The landmark of the city is without a doubt the Kuwait Towers. The main tower is 187 meters high and serves as a restaurant and water tower. It also has a viewing sphere which rises to 123 meters above sea level and completes a full turn every 30 minutes. Kuwait has some museums as well, the National Museum for example. There are several buildings with different exhibitions. One for archaeology, the Heritage Museum where you can see how people used to live in Kuwait in the old days and there's the planetarium. Another nice museum is the scientific center in Salmia. There's a Dow Harbor, a discovery place for kids and an IMAX theater. But the best part of this museum is the aquarium. You can learn about marine life from the many tanks with rays, fish and other sea creatures. The main tank holds 1.5 million liters of water and contains deep sea sharks, turtles, fish and artificial corals. There is enough to do in Kuwait to kill your time. But the main activities in Kuwait City are shopping, eating, drinking non-alcoholic beverages.